Hi, I'm Ed McCool, CEO of McCool Solutions, and this is Ed Education. Today's education is brought to you by Eric Eggert and Samantha Tucci. Eric and Samantha, take it away. When bidding out for a contractor to do work at your community association, there are definitely several factors that we insist you look upon. First is getting a certificate of insurance, which is basically a snapshot of all the coverages the contractor has in place. This is not enough though. We want to see a copy of the physical policy as well to check for all endorsements and exclusions. Absolutely, Sam. The language in the contract is going to become very important, especially in the event of a claim. Hopefully there isn't a claim, but obviously we're here to help prevent those and help protect you when that does happen. So what we'll do is we'll actually take a look at that contract and review the insurance section for you. We'll also take a look at those other policy documents that you gathered to make sure that there's not any crazy exclusions in the policy. If we see something in that policy or in the contract, we're going to make sure to point that out to you so you're aware and suggest that you do get it changed, but ultimately that's going to be up to you and your attorneys. In rare instances, the insurance company will actually step in and make certain things mandatory, but that's going to be on a case-by-case -case basis. Always let your broker know if you plan on having any work done at your association. We're happy to help review these documents for you.